Man, Katie, calm down. I already forgot. Uh, what what is her name? I didn't check the statue. Let me check the statue. <laughs> we talked to her and we're like, "What were you lost in thought about?" And then just like, man, Kaede is just like, "Hey, girl." Um. What is this? Hmm. Looks like a dragon statue. Hey. But why is there a dragon statue in the school's hallway? No. I have no idea. Maybe it's a part of the school's official art collection or something. Uh, um, Still no idea. Is that it? Okay. I, 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 I looked at it, so... Well, it matters. And we are on this floor. So yeah, this is a pretty run-down building. There's barbed wire on the windows. And can I also... Oh, that brings up the map. That's good to know. Wish I could change that. Um, there's a bunch of like plants in here though, and it's very strange. These are the restrooms. Cause there's also like stuff that's like very futuristic, like or at least like that's is, is, this building's just strange. This is the girls' bathroom, right? You know, Shuichi, do you mind waiting here? Uh, okay. Um, sure. Jeez. Don't give me that weird look. I'm just gonna check to see if there's anything inside. I doubt there'd be an exit, but just in case. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. Um. Um. The toilet seemed normal, but it's weird that the plants are growing this thick. Okay. What can I look in here? Anything? Nothing? Just this thing? Monitor is way too high tech to be used at a no school. That that's it. Well I you know, there was this thing, there could have been something in the stalls, but you know. Whatever. And I'm assuming we can't go into the boys' bathroom. This is the boys' bathroom, right? I can't go in there, not even this situation. Oh my gosh. Um, um if you want, I could go look. Huh? What? I'm not that curious about what's in there. Remember. Well, this is an unusual building. Anything could be in there. Wait, wait here a minute. With that, Shuichi opened the door and walked inside. Just normal bathroom, nothing out of the ordinary. No one was inside. I see. That scared me. Maybe detectives live for these kind of scary situations. Okay. Um. Where exactly? Okay. Uh. I'm gonna go this way. Just because there are stairs the other way. And I am assuming that we cannot go through the door that is over here. Uh, you know, if this place wasn't, like, all run down and stuff, like, it would at least look cool. Who are you? I think I know what your ultimate is. I'm... Hey. Oh, hey there. You, you guys get kidnapped, too? Well, you both look alright. That's good. No. Situation could be better, though. Yeah. Yeah, totally. Hey. Hey, let me ask you something. Do you guys remember how you got here? Um. If you're asking us, then... Ow, ow, I bit my tongue. You get experience just by walking. Yeah, um, which is because, uh... That, that makes it a lot more, uh, reasonable for you to walk everywhere instead of using the teleport. Which is cool. If you're, if you're asking us, then you don't remember either, do you? Actually. Ah, huh, you're the same way too, huh? You don't remember anything, do you? I guess that means everyone here is the same. Huh? Huh? Everyone? No. I asked the others too. They all said they don't remember. Mm. So the others don't remember either. You got me. It's like we all have amnesia or something. But... 
Ah, uh, but that's not normal if everyone here has amnesia. Well, I guess we're all in a pretty abnormal situation then. Huh? What? Oh boy. That's not true. Wait, amnesia's a stretch. We're probably just confused. I'm sure we'll remember eventually. No. Or could it be a group hypnosis? Maybe brainwashing? <laughs> in any case, I hope we remember soon. That's a shame. <laughs> I just love how it was that, like, weird, dark moment, and then, like, okay, how are you doing? Otherwise, I'll end up the outcast. Hmm. The outcast? What do you mean? How should I put this? Tell you the truth. How I got here isn't the only thing I don't remember. I also forgot my own talent. What? You got me. I'm in trouble. I know. <coughs> oh, boy. <coughs> oh, boy. That cough came out of nowhere. I'm sorry. Phew, I'm in trouble. I know I must have been some kind of ultimate. I just don't remember. Okay, well, I don't know what his ultimate is. Is that true? Oh, yeah. Of course it is. But then again, I don't blame you for not believing me. Oh. Oh, I never told you my name, did I? Not like I already told you, but then I forgot, did I? Right? No. No, oh, you haven't told me your name yet. My name is Rantaro Omaka. I can't remember my ultimate talent at the moment. <laughs> but I promise, I'm not a bad guy. Nice to meet you. This seems familiar. For someone who can't remember his talent, he doesn't seem too shaken up about it. Actually. Is it weird that I'm not really bothered by the fact that I don't remember my talent? Huh? What? I'm looking forward to it. You know, I'm actually kind of looking forward to finding it out. I wonder what talent I- or I wonder what ultimate I am. <laughs> anyway, it'd be nice if we could get along. We aren't going anywhere for a while. Jeez. Stop that, we'll escape soon. Mm -hmm. You really think it's gonna be that easy? Huh? Huh? What do you mean? No. Ultimate, not a bad guy. <laughs> Usually when somebody says they're not a bad guy, they end up killing someone. That's what I've learned from these games. That's some nice water. Um, nothing, just a feeling. <laughs> hey, don't worry about it, right? All right. I thought he would be a pretty chill guy to talk to, but I have no idea what's going through his head right now. Friendship. Oh, we actually get a bunch of experience for going through with that. Um, the school store. I'm assuming it's like the school store in the first game. Which is why I'm not being able to open it. Um. Guess this doesn't open. Let's look somewhere else. You're right. Okay. Um, the dining hall, the warehouse. Let's go to the dining hall first. <laughs> Ooh, it's nice and grassy in here. Oh, there's two people in here. Is this a dining hall? Dining hall definitely makes sense makes this place feel <laughs> a dining hall definitely makes sense a dining hall definitely makes this place feel more like a school but this place is called the ultimate academy for gifted juveniles i doubt like i doubt it's anything like a tropical school or tropical i i can't read <laughs> typical school uh dang it i tried to do tab um let's see and I can check all the monitors because they all just say the same thing. This looks to be the rules for the dining hall. Dining hall rules. You may eat any food you find in the dining hall. Please take responsibility for all utensils and dishes used and clean up after yourselves. The dining hall will be locked during nighttime. Nighttime? So it's closed at night? Okay, that is good to know. This door is blocked by barbed wire. The same goes for the classroom windows. Don't tell me the exits are blocked. Um, okay. Hmm. Seems this place has all the facilities you'd expect, but it's covered in overgrowth. Could that mean this has been abandoned for a long time? Yes. Um,. Oh boy. Uh, I'm gonna talk to you. 
Okay, I made a mistake. <laughs> I'm yelling so I can build up my spirit energy. Don't you know you can unlock your brain's full potential by yelling to the to build up spirit energy? That's I've heard that pro athletes do that. It's supposed to help you focus. Yes! I must be prepared for combat at all times, just in case someone tries to attack me. I would protect myself with Neo I, I, the, the what? Neo Akiyoto. Huh? Akiyoto, then you're Oh yes! I'm Tango Chabashira! Yeah! The ultimate Aikido master! Aikido! There we go. I see. Oh, I've always imagined Aikido masters to be huge, burly guys, but you're so cute. Cute? Oh, stop it, I'm not cute. My face crinkles when I sh suck down a shake. And when I wipe my face, my eyelids turn inside out. Mm. I see. But I think you're cute, right, Shuichi? Uh, okay. Uh, oh, right. Huh? What? <laughs> <laughs> that face! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Katie, Katie just hitting up all the girls. <laughs> Can we just admire this sprite right now? Man, man, this, is this a meme? This has, this has to have memed. I, has to. What's the matter? Your face looks really intense right now. I don't like to be praised by degenerate males. Oh boy. <laughs> wow. Degenerate males? You mean, are you uncomfortable around them? Yes. It's a way bigger problem than just being uncomfortable. If any degenerate tries to touch me, my reflex is, is to grab them and throw them across the room. Yeah. <laughs> You're right. That is a way bigger problem than just being uncomfortable around men. Hey. By the way, what is the new? Uh, oh my gosh, I forgot. A Kyoto. You mentioned. That's right. New a Kyoto is an original form of Kyoto <laughs> that my master and I completely made it up ourselves. So you're Akiyoto. Akiyoto. Is an all self time Okay. Isn't that I there's like a whole bunch of different Japanese fighting styles. Um you seem like a witch. Just saying. You have a witch hat. You are small. Where is your broom? So we're stuck here. Um. Oh uh, yeah, that's what it looks like. Uh. But don't be scared. I'm sure we'll find a way out of this place in a jiffy. No. I'm not scared. It's just pain. Something like this won't make me panic because I'm a mage. Huh? A mage? Hmm. Mm, that's right. I haven't told you guys yet. Prepare to be amazed. Fall to your knees. I am Himiko Yumeto, the ultimate mage. I love her already. <laughs> but I'm officially called the ultimate magician. There we go. I see. Oh, so you're a magician. You should have said that from the start. Mm. I mean, it makes sense though, since magic doesn't exist. Magic does exist. Huh? Huh? I... Because I am a mage. Um... You're just a magician, right? No. Only on paper. Okay. I'm known as a magician, but that's just a ruse. I'm actually a mage. Huh? Excuse me, Hogwarts is down. <laughs> um, excuse me, Hogwarts is down the street. <laughs> you ended up in the wrong school. funny just a ruse you guys might not know them but there's a group called the magic castle also known as the hall of magicians it's where the world's magic lovers gather 
I was the youngest person to ever win the Magician of the Year award. I see. That's pretty cool. Get out. It's all a ruse. Why you? They're keeping my magic a secret by distinguishing it as tricks. Because of this ruse, I became famous all over the world for performing tricks. Uh. But <laughs> I'm not a magician. I'm a mage. Nobody believes me. Um. There, there. Don't be sad. I don't hey. believe you at all. <laughs> but don't be sad. <laughs> well, you could show us your magic. Then we would believe you. That's right. Oh, that's right. Help us out with your magic. Take us back when we originally... No. Magic isn't all-powerful. I can only do so much. Hmm. I see. Then what can you do? You're right. I can choose the card you picked. Pull out coins and release doves. Hmm. If I get serious, I can even saw someone in half. Oh, boy. She's gonna kill someone. <laughs> Literally, she's... <laughs> we're gonna see somebody, like, in the next chapter... Freaking stalled in half. We're gonna be like pointing fingers at her like you did it. I already forgot her name too. Himioko? Himio. Himio. Himiko. 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 I used my <laughs> syllables. <laughs> Man, I'm gonna have to learn all of these guys' names. I really didn't even learn, like, anybody's names of, uh, the second game until, like, the fourth chapter. <laughs> ah, this is a big warehouse. Is this a warehouse? It's pretty big. Just said that. Um... They're, unlike the other rooms, there's actually more stuff that we can do. Hurdles. There are hurdles, too. We could hold our own track and field meet something with all this equipment. Okay. Why would you want to? Mat. These mats are pretty heavy. It must be a lot of work to carry these to the gym. Bet they'll be involved in a murder. <laughs> RC helicopter. Remote controlled hel- Oh my gosh. A remote controlled helicopter. <laughs> what is this doing in the school's warehouse? Um, shot pull ball? Oh, a shot put ball for track and field. Does this place even have a sports stadium? Um, what is this? This looks like a high jump pole for a track and field. I didn't expect to see professional equipment like this here. Why isn't this in the gym? That's my question. Um, Shuichi, what do you have to say? This warehouse is huge. It must be difficult to find anything. Uh, okay. Well, thanks for your input. Now we're gonna talk to this lady. Damn it! <laughs> we saw a conspicuous girl rummaging through the, a shelf filled with different chemicals. Are you some kind of chemist? Hey. Hey, what are you looking for? Bitch. Oh. Oh, you're rude. I don't even want to give you a voice. I literally just met you, and you've already called me. <laughs> hey! Hey, I'm sorry if we surprised you, but you shouldn't talk to Kaede like... Hey! What? Whoa! <laughs> Wait. Hey, Crotch Rot. Crotch Rot? What's a... What is... What? Huh? Same Shuichi. I don't understand what's happening right now. <laughs> <laughs> Help yourself, a guy like you can only dream on planning. <laughs> oh my gosh. Who does she remind me of? Crutch Rot, that's new. D d true! Go on, get yourself a good Eiffel. Uh, um. No, I wasn't staring. My eyes just happened to look you there. Shuichi! Oh, my eyes just happened to look there. Oh, my hands just happened to grow. Oh my gosh, what has she been through? Virgin. What? What? If she's seen, oh my hand just happened. If she's heard that, then what has she been through? I kind of take it back then. It's like she's been like violated. Oh my gosh. That's why you wear that hat, right? To hide your skeevy eyes. Oh boy. 
And that's why you wear those pants, right? To hide your nasty crotch. <laughs> you just passed up by my line of sight. <laughs> Oh boy, everyone wears pants though. You see, Kaede here with the right answers. <laughs> everyone knows that only pervs wear hats. Well, you all heard it here. I'm not a hat person. <laughs> oh, poor Shuichi. <laughs> Stop it. Leave me alone, I can wear a hat if I want to. Oh. Oh yeah, you stand up. What? You, you, what, what, you freaking. Oh my gosh. Startle me in a losing motivation. That loss will be felt across the whole world. Hey. Hey, your vulgar, vulgar language is uncalled for. Just who are you, anyway? Really? Huh, seriously, you don't know who I am? I'm the gorgeous girl genius whose good looks and golden brain will go down in history. I like her voice. I'm the one, the only, the legendary ultimate inventor herself, Mui Ruma. Mui? Or just Mew. Um, I've never heard of you. Um. So what kind of things do you invent? Hmm. I make all kinds of gadgets, ones that let you type Ones that let you type while you sleep, read. Ones that let you type while you sleep, read while you sleep. Everyone that lets you eat while you eat. Oh my gosh, English is hard. Reading is hard. Even ones that let you eat while you sleep. Why does everything involve sleeping? Sure. I was inspired after I realized how much time people waste on sleep. That is actually true. That's why people learn to lucid dream because they are able to. Um, they were able to unlock more life in a way. I've always wanted to lucid dream, but I just can never lucid dream. It'd be really cool though. Um, yeah. So she does kind of have a point. I can see it. Um, so this one time I invented these really stupid eyedrop contact lenses as a gag. Huh? Wait, really? That's your invention? Some of my friends wear that. She, oh, yeah. Your friends sound like total plebs. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> she did not just call our friends a pleb. You agree a third of your life... A third of your life sleeping is way too much. I wish I could lucid dream too. Yeah. I had a friend who was able to lucid dream. And I was always like, whoa. I wish I could. <laughs> Doesn't make you, doesn't make you any more productive while you sleep. So it was a failure, just like you too. Whoa, 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 calm down. I signed the, the patent rights over to some company and never looked back. That seems like a waste. It's better than your do stuff while sleeping inventions. Um. By the way, what were you looking at? What were you looking for earlier? Because I'm pretty desperate to find it. What was that? Uh, <laughs> Oh my gosh, in a situation like this, I gotta find some meds. Huh? Medicine? Are you hurt or feeling sick? Fucking moron! Oh. 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 I see. You see, when she said meds, I was like, oh, so she's probably wanting to, like, get high. Um, let's forget about the spray. Oh no, it's still there. Wait, what? You can't use drugs to get. You can't use drugs to get high. You'll, you definitely shouldn't do that. Wait. You, you can't use drugs to get high. Kaede, you obviously don't know anything. Stop it! My genius can't be constant. Constrided by the wisdom of the masses. Besides, this place probably doesn't even have <laughs> the thing I need to get loosey goosey. So, are we cool? Are you done being mad at me? Oh boy, I, that line, please forgive me, that sounds like a thing from Ning and Rumpa 2. Um, 
they say there's a fine line between genius and insanity, but she's definitely beyond insane. Okay. Goodbye, you. What's up with Shuji? He's been quiet ever since Mew mentioned his hat. Does he not like to talk about it? Poor Shuji. He did nothing wrong. <laughs> Literally, what happened? That hat must have some sentimental value to it then. Like, it's probably like his father's hat or something and his father died. That's what I'm assuming. Um... Okay, so there was over here. Um, we can't go in here yet, which is interesting. Um, oh wait. What does that say? South? Hopefully she'll become more likable later on, unless she dies really early. There was um, a character in Danganronpa 2. Uh, her name was Hyoko. And actually, I shouldn't spoil anything if you haven't seen it. I'm not sure if, if Danganronpa 2 goes into this or not, but Hyoko is a really bad character. Uh, she was very unlikable, and I kind of get that vibe from her. So, who knows? Who knows what will happen? Oh, boy. Hey! Huh?